the Green Climate Fund was created as an uh, operating entity of the um, United Nations Framework Convention on Climate Change. That's the venue where the climate change negotiation take place. And it's intended uh, to raise funding and to support projects, programs, policies, and other activities in support for developing countries uh, in their efforts to combat climate change. So it's, it's very important uh, to have such an entity. And um, this has, of course, um, happened in the context of, of an agreement um, in the climate change negotiations by developed countries collectively to um, commit to mobilize $100 billion <laughs> annually by 2020 uh, to support developing countries in these objectives. And um, so with the creation of the Green Climate Fund, there is now this momentum um, in the climate change um, discussion for scaling up this money, for delivering on this commitment. Um, and I think it's really important then to see, I mean, the Climate Fund is not fully operationalized yet. Uh, it has now a board, which is comprised of 24 members, equal representation from developed and developed countries. Uh, interestingly, uh, many members from finance ministries, which shows um, finance ministries pay a lot of attention to this new instrument. Um, they're not usually the key player in the climate change negotiations. And, um, and then the next question was for the organization, who will host uh, the climate fund? And um, there was a very intense competition among uh, major countries to host this fund. But in the end, Korea succeeded to be elected as a host country by consensus. Um, um, and, and I think there are several reasons for this I want to mention. First of all, Korea had a very strong bid, made a very strong case that it's uh, a global leader on the environment. Um, it's perceived as strongly committed to promoting the concept of green growth, which means climate change or tackling climate change is not only a challenge, but an opportunity. It's an opportunity to create economic growth. Uh, as an example, the Korean stimulus program uh, in response to the 2008 financial crisis, a major part was used for investment in, into the environment. Um, so that's very innovative. And um, maybe also one reason why Korea um, came out of the crisis quite strongly and quite quickly. Um, also, Korea has become, um, thanks to government support, um, a, a key player in, in, in technologies for green development, so which benefits not only Asia, but also other countries around the world who can make use of these technologies. And then I think um, it needs to be said that uh, Songdo Incheon is a very special place. Um, it's perceived as a city for the future. It uh, has, enorm has uh, applied uh, state-of-the-art energy efficiency programs. It's fully digitally wired. Um, it has first-class green technologies. <laughs>